wide world of trains here. All right, in this train video, we got a few good trains. We're gonna check that out in a moment. But I just wanna remind everybody to subscribe to Wide World of Trains if you haven't already. And when you watch my videos, give them a comment and a like. Tell me what you think. All right, let's get to this train video. Roll it. DPU all right. It says right here on the hoodie, DPU all right. Roll it.
How awesome was that? We had the CSX IO-17 with the Armed Forces Heritage Unit DPU all right in the middle. That is totally awesome right there. The IO-17 originates in Worcester, Massachusetts. Heads west to Chicago, Illinois, where it terminates at Bedford Park. I am about halfway between those two points. All on this Friday, April 29th, 2022, from Wide World of Trains on YouTube. On. Give the video a like if you haven't already. Go ahead and like it, subscribe to Wide World of Trains, and leave a comment. Tell me what you think of the video. That was totally cool to see as a DPU all right. Those geese over there at the pond are really quacking away over there. Or whatever geese do, squawk. Ducks quack, geese squawk. That's what it sounds like to me. All right, here comes the next video. Roll it. You can see I just missed the train up here on the bridge. trash train. Starts out in Columbus, Ohio, heads east to Selkirk, New York, where it terminates. Oh, yeah. All on this Friday. April 29th, 2022, from the Wide World of Trains on YouTube. Uh, and he's on the opposite track because of that disabled auto rack train that's back there. Everybody's going around them. It's taking quite a while to just uh, drop off one bad engine. Seems like it's taking a lot longer than it should, but who knows what they're doing. That train should be coming by as soon as they're done. They're about three, four miles behind me. So when they're done, they should be coming with just two engines because they dropped the third one off. It was engine 100 that had the bad axle, bad traction motor. All right, good actuator there. All right, here comes the train line. All right. All right, here's the next video. Roll it. Oh, first, let's take a look at Canada. All right, wait a minute on the leakage. It's a pretty clear day, so we might be able to see it pretty good. It's about 35 to 40 miles across Lake Erie. That's Welland, Ontario. Welland is, there's a Welland Canal right there. That's how ship traffic gets from the Atlantic to the upper Great Lakes to get around Niagara Falls, basically. Before that, most of the stuff went by the Erie Canal. This was built around 1825. 
Looks like we got a flock of turkey over there, about a mile away. I think they just crossed the tracks. We have a train coming in the other direction, so they'll probably scamper out of the way. There's the other train. Both trains, well, I was going to say they look like they're both on the move, but I'm not sure about the other one on the left. You can see the locomotive way to the far left. That's the one they dropped off. Joker. Wow. How awesome is this? N train DPU on the I 158. That was loud. He's a notch eight for sure. Pushing. Pushing backwards. The I-158 originates in North Baltimore, Ohio, heads east to Philadelphia, Pennsylvania, where it terminates. Right about there is where the turkey were. They took off for obvious reasons. Yeah, it terminates in uh, Philadelphia, Pennsylvania, heading east, all on this Friday, April 29th, 2022, from Wide World of Trains on YouTube. Uh, See if we can get a better view of this. We can watch it further. There's the whole complete train from end, beginning to end right there. Very cool DPU all right. Go ahead and give the video a like and if you haven't already subscribe to Wide World of Trains on YouTube. And leave a comment even if it's a nice video or a cool train or something more elaborate you want to talk about the train go ahead and do that too. Or if you got stories about your own train experience or if you worked on the railroad let me hear them. 
It's all good here at Wide World of Trains and YouTube. He's about a mile away now. Maybe a little longer. All right, here comes the next video. Roll it. Oh, before we roll it, let's uh cross over here again. See if that disabled train is on the move. It doesn't look like it. I'll zoom in. Let's see what we see. Hey, he's still in the same spot. That's three miles away right there. Try to zoom in a little better. There you go. There's the disabled locomotive on the left. Looks like he'd be ready to move. Oh, I thought I saw the conductor or engineer walking on the front there. Like another reflection on the right hand side of the locomotive. Probably from the sun. All right, here comes the next video. Roll it. It's getting greener every day that I come out here. Spring is here, finally. Hold it. Don't click away, because there's more trains to come. There always is a wide world of trains, because you ain't seen nothing yet. Here's the next video. Roll it. Thirty-one seventy and eight fifty-one were the numbers. Seven thirty two. Symbol on that train is CSX IO17. That train originates in Worcester, Massachusetts, heads west to Chicago, Illinois, where it terminates at Bedford Park. All on this Thursday, April 28th, 2022, from Wide World of Trains and YouTube. Uh, here comes the next video. Roll it.
cool was that? Brand new SD70. Or, uh, CM44 C6M, AC44 C6M uh, leading. Brand new rebuild. That was in the 4500 uh, range number. They started out with engine 4000, so they've made over 500 of them rebuilt so far. Symbol is NS206. That train starts out at the 63rd Street Yard in Chicago, Illinois. Heads east to Buffalo, New York, where it terminates at the Bison Yard. All on this Sunday, April 24th, 2022, from Wide World of Trains and YouTube. Uh, here comes the next video, we'll roll it. But first, we're going to walk over to CSX, of course. Just in case. Be cool to get another long range train meet here. If something's coming, it must be far away because I don't hear anything. Nope, nothing down there and nothing over there. All right, on to the next video. Roll it. Fire engine. Symbol on that train is CSX I-165. The 165 originates in Montreal, Quebec, Canada. Heads west, crosses the Niagara River near Buffalo. Once it does, does that, it changes from CP-143 to I-166. CSX crews take over. They operate the train all the way to Chicago, Illinois, where it terminates at Schiller Park. All on this Thursday, April 28th, 2022, from Wide World of Trains and YouTube. Uh, and go ahead and give the video a like. It helps my channel out. And if you can watch another one of my videos, if you have time, go ahead and do that. 
and leave a comment even if it's nice video or cool train or if you want to elaborate and talk more about the train or what you think about it do that too all right here comes the next video roll it i hear another horn but i don't know if it's him or what we will see i guess Got lots of horn action here. Symbol on that train is Norfolk Southern 206. 206 originates in Chicago, Illinois at the 63rd Street Yard. Heads east to Buffalo, New York, or terminates at the Bison Yard. I'm about 35, 40 miles from Buffalo. So he's almost home free there. All on this Tuesday, April 19th, 2022, from Wide World of Trains on YouTube. little bit different view today all right here comes the next video roll it there's wide world of trains right there <laughs> 